Is it recording? Is it recording? It might be. I don't know. I'm gonna express it out. Express it yourself. <laughs> I'm Liza. I'm Lowen. And today we're gonna be reviewing our Nespresso machine. Yeah, this lovely beauty right here. <laughs> yes, if you like our channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Don't forget, if you like anything you see here today in the review, go ahead and click on the link and you can get all the product on the link. Like the video, comment below if you wanna see more like this. So let's go ahead and make two cups of coffee. I thought you were gonna do one. She make two. Always start with warming up your creamer in your original machine. And there's only one button you need to press for it to start spinning and foaming up. That's how it looks once it's done foaming. You wanna choose your coffee, open up your machine, your nice metal machine, drop your pot in, close it. And you wanna twist it so those two white lines line up. So you should hear that sound. That's your cup adjuster. Adjust it to the size of cup that you have. I have a really tall tumbler. Wait for the light to go solid and then press start. We have the coffee coming out of the Nespresso machine. Crema on the top and the coffee's on the bottom. Go ahead and pour in your creamer and you can top it with uh, anything you want actually. Pop it open and uh, pod automatically dispenses itself. Make sure you save one of these, um, cut out the top of it and save it, pop it back into your Nespresso machine with nothing in there and you go ahead and press start and clean your machine. Easy as one, two, three. Open it up, any excess water, dump it right into the cup. Now you got a clean machine. So I hope you guys liked us making a video. I Real have simple. an espresso shot. And I got the regular coffee shot. Yes. It's actually a regular cup of coffee. Yeah. Yum. Hold on. Let's do a taste test. Oh. <laughs> Mine's is really, really strong. The espresso shot is really, really strong. Let me taste your coffee. I like it. You taste my espresso. Mmm. Hey. Seriously. It's super good. I'm gonna be mm. right now. This is really good though. It really is. I, honestly, I, I hardly drink coffee, but I, I drink this. And you don't even have to put sugar. I mean, we put a little bit of topping on it, white chocolate, because I like white chocolate mocha. Yeah, Seriously, you can tell the difference good. between regular coffee. And this and coffee. other machines, too. You can yeah, tell the difference. Yeah, because we've had the K-Cup one before. Is yeah. K-Cup or Keurig? Keurig. We had a Keurig before. And that, the quality of the coffee is not the same. It's all right. It's, it's okay, but it definitely doesn't make it as good as this one. Um, if you're wondering, these pods are, they come out to about $1.10 per pod. So one cup of coffee is $1.10. Um, oops! And here's the espresso ones, they're really small, kind of like this. Somebody wants my coffee. Keep dropping it. But totally worth it. I mean, if you're spending 5 or $6 at Starbucks for a cup of coffee, $1.10 with some creamer comes out to a what, what, what? $2. Yeah. for a cup of coffee. At and most. this is really good quality coffee. I can say that because I've drank all types of coffee. You drink all kinds of coffee. <laughs> you can also make cold coffee, mm -hmm. iced coffee. You can make, um, you can blend it. If you want to see a video that. on how we make our special coffees, kind of like Starbucks kind of coffees, um, give us a thumbs up and we'll, we'll make a video like that. Give me a thumbs up. Sure. Express on yourself! At least you can clean the house now. Now that you have all this energy. Mm. Okay. Okay. This is actually really good. Do you have heard anything in this video? Uh, okay. Make sure they click on my link. And click on the link after that. <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy my drink while you click on my link. Is it on yet? I can't see you. Go more back. Oh. Is it off yet? <laughs>